something new for me and that is create like a fall tablescape in my dining room. I bought some new dishes which we have not bought new dishes in so long you guys. We still use the white Ikea dishes which there's nothing wrong with that but it was time for an upgrade. Something that matched our house a little bit better and I've been looking for like the perfect set of dishes and I have not found anything I liked. And then the other day I was in Kirkland's which who knew that Kirkland's was cool? I remember Kirkland's from like when I was a little kid, there was one in our mall and I felt like it was such an old person store. <laughs> maybe, maybe now I've just grown up and it's like the exact same store or maybe their style has gotten a little bit cooler. But I was with my friend and she mentioned wanting to go in there and I was like, I haven't been in a Kirkland since I was like eight years old. And they had such cute stuff, you guys. So pretty much everything from my tablescape is from Kirkland's other than the flatware and the glasses. All of the plates, the runner, the centerpiece, everything was from Kirkland's. I'm a big fan now. The flatware that I ended up choosing is a set of champagne flatware from Target. I asked on Instagram if you guys had any like champagne colored flatware that you've had for a while that you've ran through the dishwasher multiple times and it hasn't become discolored because I did buy gold flatware from West Elm and it got discolored so quickly. It turned silver probably in like 10 washings, which just is crazy to me because it's said to be dishwasher safe. And they do have a great return policy. They were able to refund it, no big deal. But I did wanna try a new set. So I am trying the Target set because a lot of people said that that was good. The reviews are very mixed online. So I will update you guys on whether it actually stays nice or if it doesn't. But for now, for the tablescape, that is what I ended up picking up. And the glasses are also from Target. Like I said, everything else is from Kirkland's. I will try to link everything below. Anything that is still in stock, I will have linked below. Before I go down there and actually put together the tablescape, I did want to thank the sponsor of today's video, HelloFresh. You can go to hellofresh.com slash lfowler14 and use the code lfowler14 for up to 14 free meals plus three gifts. That's new. The holidays can be hectic, but HelloFresh helps keep things simple with recipes and ingredients that cut out grocery shopping and limit your meal prep time so you can spend more of the festive season with your friends and family. HelloFresh offers a wide variety of quick and easy recipes, including 20 minute meals, easy cleanup, and low prep options. I have yet to try a recipe that I didn't like. I truly, truly mean that. The food is delicious. The meal that I cooked yesterday were the these onion cheeseburgers. They were so delicious, you guys. It had potato wedges on the side. James loved it. He was dipping it in his little sauce. And of course, I ate the entire thing. It was so freaking good. Their hamburgers are like delicious. If you're a hamburger person, definitely choose a hamburger recipe for your box. <sighs> chef's kiss. So if you're ready to try HelloFresh, they are ready to hook you up with a great deal. You can go to hellofresh.com slash lfowler14 and use the code lfowler14 for up to 14 free meals plus three free gifts. Thank you so much HelloFresh for sponsoring another video and sending us boxes of the most delicious meals that I can make for me and my son and it just makes us really happy. So thank you. James, do you want a cheeseburger? Got a little mini 
hamburger and french fries and dip. And this is mommy's. I'm going to eat this one because it's not hot. Okay, you're going to dip it in the dip? Okay, I'm going to do it. Okay. Good job. It is good. Good. You got to use the other side of your fork too. Yeah. <laughs> you know it too. That's, that was funny. Yum. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm going to go downstairs and put my tablescape together. I'm so excited. I've never done this. I hope that I can actually pull it off and that it will actually look cohesive and put together because I bought the pieces, but I haven't actually seen them like together. I also spent the day taking down some of our Halloween decorations, putting them away for next year, and just getting our house prepped a little bit for the holiday decorations that are coming. I know a ton of Instagram moms had their Christmas trees up the day after Halloween, November 1st. I'm not quite as fast as that. Um, we did enjoy Halloween for a couple days after Halloween. James kept wearing his costume. We kept eating candy, I know. But it's time to put all of those things away and really transition our house to be a little bit Thanksgiving-y and then we're gonna start holiday decorating, which I'm so excited about. Here is a before of our dining room. As you can see, it doesn't have a ton of decor, but it is pretty and it looks mostly put together. I'm gonna start by giving this room a little bit of TLC. As you can see, the linen on these chairs have gotten really wrinkled over time. So the first thing I'm going to do is steam the wrinkles out of these chairs. I'm using this black and Decker steamer. I also took some time to vacuum this room really well and also use a fabric pillar on a couple areas on these chairs that have just gotten snagged over time. So just taking a few extra moments to really give this room some attention that it's been needing and not receiving for a while. Moving on to the actual tablescape. I started out with this runner that I picked up from Kirkland's. I really love this. The only problem is it is a standard 80 inch long runner and it is too short for this table as you can see. On top of that, I made this little stack of dishes with a charger underneath, two different size dishes and a napkin. So I started off with this black charger. This is from Kirkland's. It's wooden and so it's not something you eat off of. It's meant to be the base of your plate stack. On top of that, I added these large tan plates. I love this color. I think it works really well with our house. And like I said earlier in this video, I picked this out knowing that we would use it year round in this house. On top of that, I put these linen napkins that I picked up from Kirkland's. These came in a pack of four and I placed that underneath these cream medium sized dishes. So these four items together has made my little stack. I think it's really pretty. Next to it, I did add the champagne flatware from Target, and then I added these cute little cocktail glasses also from Target. This centerpiece is absolutely beautiful. It is from Kirkland's, and the second I saw it, I knew that I wanted it. I feel like this is the perfect fall and winter centerpiece because it does have the pompous, which is very fall, but it also has pine cones, which are very wintry. So I think this is beautiful and will see me through the new year, and then I can always replace it with a more year-round centerpiece for the rest of the year. Here is the completed tablescape. I love it. I think it's so pretty. I think that this table runner could use a nice steam with my steamer. Um, I didn't notice that, but it's showing up really strongly on camera, so I will take care of that. But I love the way this turned out. I love these dishes. I love the flatware. I hope that it keeps up nicely in the dishwasher. And overall, I just think that this entire look is just so pretty put together. Okay, I'm thrilled with how that turned out. I think it's so pretty. I'm just gonna leave it up through like this entire season. I might make it a little bit Christmassy in December. We'll see. I might actually swap out the tan orange color for like a red 
We'll see. If I can do something easy to swap it out, I will. Otherwise, I think this is something that matches my house. It's going to be something that I can use year round. These are plates that we're just going to use as our regular plates when they're not out for like decorative use um, because they do match the aesthetic and the coloring of our house. The only thing that really feels super fall to me is the centerpiece, which we can switch out throughout the year. But I think the actual plates themselves and the like coloring of the black and the tan and the cream really just go with the house and I think that it's something that I picked out knowing we would use it year-round. For the first time since purchasing our house two years ago, I feel like our house is finally coming together. I know that we have to do the nursery, I want to finish James's room, I want to do a few things in the playroom, but my to-do list on this house is shrinking and I can like see the light at the end of the tunnel and it makes me so happy. I feel like moving into a new house, especially if you're having to buy new furniture and stuff, it's just, it takes forever. It's so hard. I mean, unless you work with an interior decorator that does the whole thing in like four months and brings it all on the same day and like sets your house up for you, which you know, that is great, but it costs a ton of money. If you're doing it yourself, it just takes so long. My goal is to have this house done. And I say done in air quotes because I don't think that a house is ever fully done. I think there's always things on your wish list to improve, but done in terms of like feeling like it's at a really good stopping point before this baby comes. That is my goal. I have until early April. So we'll see with the holidays and everything, it might not actually happen, but I feel like I see the light at the end of the tunnel. Like I feel like we can do this. So that's my goal. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much HelloFresh for sponsoring another video and hooking us up with delicious meals. And I will see you guys in my next one. Goodbye.